This is the overview for the Germ Fighter game. A client has laid out some specifics exactly what they want for this game. Uh, they want the hero, which they've given you the all the uh, files for this. Uh, if you go to the classroom, you can see all the files, audios, and uh, everything is laid out here for you. Uh, so you can take those files and download them. Uh, that the hero is located on the bottom, that you can drag that hero. The germ starts at the top, bounces off the uh, top right and left edges. Uh, if it hits the germ itself, it should bounce off. And the player wins if they survive 10 seconds. Uh, without giving up the edge of the screen, and they lose when time is up. Before time is up, the bottom edge is reached. So just to show you the demo of this, we can see here I hit my start button. My character is draggable. Uh, we have the sounds oh. placed. It hits. Uh, I'm going to turn the sound off and reset. The reset button resets it. You can also see the top score every time I, the white blood cell hits the germ that the uh, score goes up. And we can see I won with a score of three uh, and I get the great job screen. So this is the basis for design that you want to uh, create for the client. After creating that for the client, what you need to do is pitch the client other ideas. So you want to increase the playability of this game, which we've talked about multiple times. Maybe you can add lives to the game. Uh, maybe changing that game timer using an algorithm. And for every point you get, you get a certain amount of seconds added to your clock. Uh, increasing the difficulty. Maybe multiple germs come on screen or the speed of the germ uh, changes based on algorithms or adding a level or a high score option. So it's really up to you to give you give the client exactly what they want, but then approving upon it with some other uh, skills and that you would find as a user um, more creative. So again, uh, this is the basics for the design screen layout. Uh, we have a score, we have a timer, we have the graphics, they've given us a start button, a reset button, a sound on and off button. Uh, I'll give you some tips and tricks when it comes to the coding, uh, but this is really your time to shine uh, as we're into semester uh, two of this course to show what you're able to code and make a game that you're proud of.